Hello everybody, it's our evening prayers. You might be able to see uh, Rosie is in the back, bless her. She's spent uh, quite a bit of time in the garden today. I hope you have um, been able to get some sunshine as well today as we prepare for tomorrow. Tomorrow, that glorious day of resurrection. But we need to remember that resurrection occurs every single day. Let's pray, shall we? God of peace, quieten our hearts and help us to be still in your presence. And we find this so hard to do, for our lives are full of noise and confusion, anxieties and worries. And sometimes these can seem to press in on every single side. And we normally run here and there doing this and that, always something else to think about, another pressing, demanding matter. And then suddenly we find ourselves in a very, very different situation. Our nation is in the midst of something we can't really get our head around. In one sense, we are watching from a distance through a television screen, but in another sense, it is so clear and so near. And we have been allowed to stop. We've been told to stop. And so in our stopping, May we start afresh with you. May we realise what we have forgotten in the busyness of yesterdays. God of peace, we offer you now this little space we have made. And we pray that you would meet us here so that we may return to our daily routine with a new perspective. May tomorrow bring a new perspective because of this night. May this season, this anxious season, ultimately bring a resolve to make time for you regularly so that we can use our time more effectively and better in the service of your kingdom. Sovereign God, we don't understand how you raised Jesus from the dead. How you breathed life into his body, how you rolled the stone away from the tomb, how he appeared unrecognised to Mary in the garden and to the disciples on the Emmaus Road. We don't understand how we walk through locked doors to be with the apostles and how he repeatedly appeared from nowhere to stand among his followers. But what we do understand is this, that he changed the lives of all who met him, turning their sorrow into celebration, their despair into hope, and their doubt into faith. And that he is with us now, through his life-giving spirit. We thank you, Father God, that a resurrection happens every single day. That you remake our lives every single day. That death is not the end. And we might not understand, but we do believe and we rejoice and we offer you our grateful worship. We 
I just think of how those first disciples must have felt on this night all those years ago. Help us to pause and ponder. And may we treasure up in our hearts the glorious good news of new life and new birth, a new dawn, a new light and resurrection. Help us to be still with you this evening and may we rest well to rise early to see the sunrise of your promise. And so, Father, may we breathe in and breathe out your Ruach, your Spirit. And with every beat of our hearts, with every blink of an eye, with every tear shed, with every smile shed, may we sense your presence now and forever. Amen. Good night, everybody. Take care. God bless.